Right. We got Will from Beer World. Hello, Will. Good morning, guys. Welcome Hello. back. Uh, well, thank you. It's good to be back. And yes. I noticed you brought a friend with you today. I too. did. I did. So, uh, out of the beautiful Sullivan County Catskills up in Livingston Manor, we've got Chris LaFaro from the Catskill Brewery. Oh, good, good morning, Chris. everybody. All right, so the Catskill uh, Brewery, where, where are you guys uh, located? I'm so, in we're out in the western part of the Catskill Mountains in Sullivan County, a uh, little hamlet. Called, uh, called Livingston Manor, on the Beautiful way to Binghamton. Yeah, actually. very nice up there. Yeah, Livingston Manor is sort of the, uh, the heart of uh, fly fishing country. Mm -hmm. All right, so now you brought this uh, beer with you, and I'm, it's a nice, uh, nice cloudy, was this an IPA? It's this is an IPA, it like it's an IPA. called Devil's Pass. Devil's Pass? Yes, it's an unfiltered IPA. Mm. And uh, over the years, we uh, discovered some wonderful hops out of Michigan. So while we could be sourcing from New York State for this beer or from the West Coast for this beer, uh, we've designed this now to be an all Michigan hops uh, mm. offering. This is good. Yeah, I, I like this a lot. Mm -hmm. This is really good. This is, this, now this is named after that trail, right? It is exactly right. Uh, most of our beers have names that refer to things around, uh, in, or about the Catskills, uh, in part because part of our mission is to be ambassadors uh, of the Catskills out to the world so that we can spread the the idea that it's a beautiful place, it's a fun place to be, and uh, it's where we established ourselves sitting on some great water so we can make some great beer. What a better way to uh, be an ambassador and to spread the word than, than through beer. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> that's, that's great. This is delicious. Yeah. 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 I don't like that much, but this is delicious. <laughs> well, we intentionally uh, brew our hoppy beers, whether they're ales or lagers, uh, to be very expressive with the hops, but not too bitter. All right. Now, so now you say the hops are from Michigan, but is this more of like a New England style IPA? Cause That's it's exactly cloudy? right. Because yep. it's cloudy, because it's uh, a lot of hop character without too much bitterness. Uh, it's a soft mouth feel, and uh, it's pretty easy drinking for all those reasons. Uh, and easy, what's the alcohol? Yeah, I was going to say easy drinking, but there's a little kick to this, right? This one is 7.5%. Yeah, I can tell. Easy. I can tell. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Easy drinking, doesn't taste boozy. No, it's really no, good. No, no, no. Yeah. Appropriate balance with the malt character to keep us coming back for more. Yeah, you definitely don't want to go on that devil's path with, uh, you know, after having a few of these. Yeah. True <laughs> enough. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe so, after the hike. So now, you, you guys have been around for a few years now, right? Like yeah, this is so? our fourth year. We're coming up on our fourth anniversary. And... Uh, We've been, uh, you know, doing our part to make great beer and talk about the Catskills and yeah. and. So uh, now, now, why did you decide to to go into brewing? So, like four years ago, you guys you guys started up. I know there's a lot of breweries. Everybody has a different story why yeah. they go into it. Why did Why did you decide to start brewing beer? Well, it really the specific purpose that uh, the partners had in mind was they all are in love with the Catskills. Some of them are full time residents. Uh, others live as far away as Virginia, and. They wanted to start a business that featured uh, something from the Catskills so that they could tout the Catskills and, and really share their love out into the world. And they did a lot of thinking and looking and experimenting. And then they realized, hey, we're sitting on this great water. Yeah. Let's make beer. So, and I know um, the whole idea of the brewery too is not just uh, to promote the Catskills, but also to kind of give back to the Catskills too. Uh, you're very responsible with the way you use energy and things, right? With the with the brewery. That's correct. Our facility is a carbon neutral production facility, and what that means is uh, we are powered by the sun. Uh, we have a robust geothermal system in the brewery, and uh, any electra any extra electricity that we need, we buy with what are called wind credits. Really? So yeah. That's awesome. And the building, that's pretty cool. The building is uh, gold lead certified. That's a certification given to uh, facilities that are have lived up to a certain set of standards. Lead stands for Leadership in Energy and Environmental Design. Wow. And we're really proud to uh, to be one of the first uh, in New York State and actually one of the first in the country to be a lead certified production facility. Well, I got to tell you, this IPA was delicious before, but now I feel even better drinking. <laughs> right? I feel good about, I feel well, like good about my carbon footprint. What yeah, is that? You know, I'm doing all these great things. I'm promoting the cat skills. I'm lowering the carbon footprint. I'm uh, enjoying a nice IPA. This is yeah, a great experience. Nice. And you, sir, <laughs> look a little bit like a young George Siegel. <laughs> Just saying. That's a compliment, I think. That's nice and obscure. I'll take that compliment. <laughs> this is what happens when you give Rob a very high yeah, alcohol don't IPA. Do it. Yeah. <laughs> 
All right, Chris LaFaro, thanks so much for joining us this morning. Uh, if you want to check out the uh, brewery up at uh, in Catskill, uh, up in Livingston Manor, uh, you got a website people can uh, find? Yeah, catskillbrewery.com. Come visit us. On the weekends, we have food. We have a fantastic tap room in that uh, lead certified gorgeous barn of a building we've got. Yeah, go check and out uh, we'd love to have you. All right, Chris, thanks so much. I appreciate it. My pleasure. Uh, thanks for we'll, having me. We'll, we'll see you next week. Yes, you will. Uh, you, I'm assuming the beers uh, from Catskill are also available at Beer World. They sure. are. One thing that Chris didn't mention is that they uh, just started releasing cans, which uh, as a retail place, we are very excited about. So uh, we do have the Devil's Path and their Darby's currently in cans. and. A uh, couple new cans coming to look out for uh, in the coming weeks. Uh, and you can get those at our locations, 1221 Ulster Ave in Kingston, Mill Street in Liberty, Route 42 in Monticello, Route 17M in Monroe, Brookside Ave in Chester, Bridge Street in Catskill, and online at beerworldstore.com. All right, thanks, Will. We'll see you next week. Thanks very much. Right.